Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello, how are you? I hope you all guys in very good condition I know uh, during this pandemic era Maybe some of us feeling depressed, feeling lonely, maybe feeling insecure But uh, don't worry guys, we have to believe we will pass this pandemic together So, cheer up By the way Mm, I am Anzu Putri Maulina and you can call me Anzu as well uh, Here I am going to talking about something written behind me Can you guys see it? Can you read it? Can you? Can you? Yes, it's Romolon mm, I have a question for you Are you guys reading this month with full of excitement? Yes, so do I Why? Yes, of course, Allah blesses us with this month. Allah gives us um, a chance to get back to Him, to repent to Him uh, after doing many sins in the past. Uh, even more, Allah gives us what we call that? Yes, a special night called Laylatul Qadar. Um, and whoever doing worship, doing kindness uh, in that night, Allah will give him or her reward like reward like thousand years of worshipping. Um, if I calculate it, it is more than 83 years and the average of humankind lifespan is about 60 years. It's marvelous, isn't it? So, um, don't you guys want it? Of course, so do I. Then, if you guys asked me about the people who are lost their chance to get back to Allah, to repent to Allah in the month of Ramadan, is there any people like that? Well, let me think. Yes, there is. Okay, let me tell you about these four kind of people who are losing their chance to get reward in the month of Ramadan the first is people who ask just fasting and hold their hunger and thirst but they are get nothing this kind of people they are fasting but they also doing um like gossips and lying not telling the truth um and do some kind of maksia activities yes of course uh, this kind of activities will remove the rewards of fasting itself um, it narrated by Alto Brani how many how many people fast but they do not get from the fast except hunger and thirst then the second kind of people who are losing the chance in Ramadan is People who do not following the Imam of Traweh until the end. I mean completely following the Imam of Traweh. Also, uh, it is narrated in a hadith by Tirmidhi, Ibn Majah, and Ahmad. People who pray Traweh uh, follow the priest to completion written for him the reward of praying all night long. Hmm. Just following the Imam praying Traweh and get all night long reward. It is a good deal, right? We often see that there are many people who left the mosque, who left the masjid before the Traweh prayer is started. Maybe some of them uh, like talking outside the masjid, and there are many children who playing uh, around the masjid when the Traweh prayer is started it is unfortunately then uh, the third kind of people who are losing the chance in Ramadan is the people who are rarely read the Quran there are many advantage of reading Quran uh, we will get many rewards by reciting Quran it is also stated in the hadith narrated by Tirmidhi, whoever reads one letter from the Quran, 
learn for him one goodness and one goodness is multiplied to 10 rewards I am not saying alif lam mim is one letter but alif is one letter lam is one letter and mim is one letter so if we finish reciting Quran once then how many rewards we will get at the end it is once how about twice and three times and many times then the fourth kind of people who are losing the chance in the Ramadan is people who don't keep do not keep their salah their prayer we are obliged to do prayer to keep our prayer um in our whole lifetime uh, in the judgment day it is also mentioned in the hadith narrated by Thirmidhi in fact the first time of servants deed will be judged on the day of resurrection is his prayer if his prayer is good then he is lucky and when his prayer is broken it will be a real loss so prayer is the most important practice of worshiping Allah we have to keep it every day okay maybe that's all that I can deliver to you if there are many mistakes forgive me and correct me in the comment section below I hope we will get better Ramadan this year and also get Laylatul Qadar Amin Allah um, thank you for listening to me and I hope we will meet in Jannah insyaAllah wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh